If you're looking for a new way to create amazing art, you may want to check out Midjourney AI. With this tool, you can generate images just like this from a computer by simply typing in some text. The results can be quite stunning, and it's all just a matter of clicking a button. Today, I'm going to show you how to use Midjourney AI to create your own art. We'll start by choosing a topic, and then we'll let the computer do the rest. So let's get started. Let's get started. In order to use Midjourney, you need to sign up for a Discord account. You can find it at discord.com or just type in Discord into your browser and click Go. Once you've registered and verified your email, you can head over to midjourney.com and get started with your free trial. After you click on Join the Beta, you will now click on Join Midjourney, accept the invite, and then continue to Discord. Now you will find yourself on the Midjourney page. This is where you will write your prompt to create your images. The first thing you should do is click on Getting Started to get yourself familiarized with Midjourney. For now, let's go straight to one of the newbie channels to start learning how to use Midjourney. Remember, this is a public channel. Whatever images that you create will be available for everyone to see and use. So, let's head down to the text box at the bottom of the page to start writing some prompt. So, to get started, you need to type slash imagine, press space, and the prompt box will shows up. In the prompt box, that's where you will type whatever you want to create. Let's start by typing something interesting and see what comes up. Let's type a colorful butterfly. After you type your prompt and press enter, you will need to scroll up or down to find your creation. The AI will generate an image of what it thinks a colorful butterfly is. However, using one adjective like colorful is usually not sufficient. But, let's take a look at what the AI came up with. You usually have to wait around 60 seconds for the AI to generate the images. The images that are generated are based on the keywords that you've provided. Here are the four images that the AI have created. And if you like an image, you can either upscale it or make variations of it. Now, let's try a different prompt that is more specific and more advanced. A rainbow-colored butterfly flying across a field of flowers during a sunset. So, you see the AI produced exactly what we requested instead a generic prompt like colorful. Now, we have a beautiful rainbow-colored butterfly flying across a field of flowers. After that, you can pick any one of the pictures to upscale and generate a better quality image. We now have our beautiful butterfly image. We can click to open it and use it however we want. But to even generate a better quality of this image, we can click upscale to max. Not only it will generate a larger image, but it will also add a lot more details to it. Remember that each user have only 25 queries, including upscales and variations. After you've used up all 25 queries, you need to buy a membership to continue using the AI. Now, let me show you how to access all the images that you have created. You simply go to midjourney.com and log into your account. And you can also access the community feed and see all the hot images that others have created. You can find a lot of inspiration for the community. Let's say you find an image that you really like and would like to create something similar. You can click on these three dots here and copy the prompt to go through the code. You can try it for yourself or modify it to produce a completely different result. On the community page, you'll find all sorts of inspiring mid-journey ideas that will help bring your imagination alive. Now, after you have tried mid-journey for yourself, and if you do decide to sign up for a paid account, this is how you can do it. Click on the three dots next to your username at the bottom left corner of the page, then click on Manage Plan. 
you have two options, a basic membership for $10 per month. You will be limited to only 200 images with incremental billing and a standard membership for $30 per month with unlimited personal use and access to member gallery. So there you have it guys. You have just learned how to use Midjourney AI and on the next video I will show you how and where to get more creative prompts to create your own masterpiece. I hope you liked the video and if you do, remember to like, comment and subscribe to our channel.